What's up guys? We're back. It's been a while, but it feels good to be back. We got a match against Nathan. I'm going to lead off with my Octillery. He's going to lead off with his Galvantula. Start off, he sets up his Sticky Webs. Typical Galvantula setup so far. I'm going to go for the Flamethrower and somehow miss. And then he goes for the nice safe energy ball. Gets some super effective damage on me. Takes me down to 12 HP with the crit. Doesn't matter anyway. It's going to be a two hit KO on me. Flamethrower lands. Takes him down. He's going to finish me off with the energy ball. He wouldn't get that second energy ball off if I didn't miss that initial flamethrower. But it's Pokemon. What do you do? So I'm going to come out with my Haunch Crow and hit him up with the Sucker Punch. Knowing that he outspeeds me. That's going to knock him out. You'll see this is a critical hit. This is actually my super luck with Razor Claw Haunch Crow as opposed to a Moxie Haunch Crow. Uh, for whatever reason, he decides to send in his throw. That's easily going to go down to my uh, Brave Bird. Not sure of the thinking there, but you know. And lastly, he's going to send out this Crawdon. And the same trick he has up his sleeve, I have up mine. So I'm going to go ahead, hit him up with a Brave Bird. Just going to take him down to his Sash. Sash is going to activate. He's going to go for the Dragon Dance. Uh, with this Dragon Dance, he's at plus one attack, plus one speed. And then, um, fun fact, he's actually going to outspeed me. I'm going to click Sucker Punch just because I only have to do one HP, but his Aqua Jet... Beats me out since he's now technically faster. I'm going to send out my Swoobat. This is a simple slash focus sash Swoobat. So he's going to hit me up with a knockoff. That's going to prop my focus sash. I just have to do 1 HP of damage. So I'm going to just hit him up with an air slash. Nice and safe. And then that's going to be the match. So a good game to Nathan.